Hey there, I'm back. Well, I've been super busy at work, just haven't had much time to create and post any videos. Well, except for the little shorts about the C8 Corvette daily production numbers. I think a lot of people have been appreciating that. But when I saw this article, I figured that a lot of people out there would like to hear what it had to say. So I'm gonna go over it today. On Monday, John, one of the co-founders of the Mid-Engine Corvette Forum, posted an article that was full of very exciting news regarding the 2023 C8 Corvette Z06 production. I've got notes here, so I'll make sure I'm accurate. I think anyone that's on a list for a Z06 will be very encouraged by these facts and opinions. He titles the article, Z06 is making sustained progress towards customer production. He starts out by saying he wants to clear the air stating that the Z06 is making steady progress and he has learned good news that he has cooperated with several insiders of GM. He goes on to say that he decided to write this article because of the number of messages and calls that he's gotten regarding the rash of posts and videos with unsubstantiated claims that the Z06 sky is falling. This is definitely not true. In fact, quite the opposite. The Z06 looks to be on track for a summer release. Good news, people. Now here are the facts as presented by John. The Z06 remains on track for summer production of customer units. That could be you. Exciting news. The LT6 is not having overheating issues. The first actual sellable CTF units have arrived in Michigan. Now remember the cars are assembled in Kentucky and then must be shipped to Michigan. Now the 100% covers on the JCT transported Highwing Z07s do not relate to anything negative being hidden from our site, but to something he learned at the bash. Now that's intriguing. JCT is a transport company and the bash refers to the Corvette bash at the Corvette Museum. GM Finance has not yet determined the Z06 price. And we all kind of knew that. Now, according to John, these are all cooperative facts. I hope so. Now, here are some of the opinions that he has drawn from these facts. These opinions were not GM confirmed, but are solely his opinions based on the previously mentioned communications with GM insiders. John being super intensely focused on the Corvette for four decades and some additional sources. Opinion number one, we will not receive the Z06's MSRP until probably sometime early next month, meaning July. Nicely, July starts in just seven or eight days. However, GM sometimes likes to repeat special events within its Corvette history. And many of you might know that Thursday, June 30th, was the day that the first production Corvette pulled off the line in 1953. And John believes that this might be the day that we receive the MSRP on the Z06. I don't know about that. I think that he might be a little bit over optimistic with that June 30th date. We'll have to wait and see. I hope so though. Then very soon after the CAZ06 is price released, GM will release the official Z06 order guide. Following the order guide's release, Leaders will be getting the first DOSP Z06 allocations and will be notified. He is guessing that Thursday, July 14th will be that date. For dealers are most often notified of upcoming DOSP allocations the Thursday before ordering the initial orders. DOSP is the dealer order submission process or the weekly ordering cycle that the dealers go through. Opinion number two. The first of the Z06 orders will go in along with the next round of Stingray allocations on July 21st. That sounds wonderful, doesn't it? The preceding timeline is fully consistent with Harlan sharing with all at the bash that the Z06 pricing will be released a bit ahead of time and that no one will order price blind. No one will order price blind, Harlan? 
That is an interesting statement considering that several hundred 2023 Stingrays were ordered price blind. I hope it's true though. John then goes on to speak about the disappointment that many buyers have had, enthusiasts have had about this whole process. I won't go into all that. I'll link the full article down below in the description. So if you'd like to read the full article, you just go there and click on that. That's really good stuff. If true, it should help a lot of Z06 buyers breathe a sigh of relief knowing that their 2023 Z06 Corvette will be on the way soon, huh? Now, if you'd like more information about the Z06s, I've got a playlist and you can just click on it right up here and you'll find plenty of videos on the Z06. Thanks for watching. As always, this is Tim. See ya.